Governor Dan McKee is coming under fire for not requiring masks in schools. He has said that school districts should follow CDC guidelines, which call for universal masking regardless of vaccination status. But he's leaving the decision up to each district. Both Secretary of State Nellie Gorbea and General Treasurer Seth Magaziner say science points to a mask mandate. Today, the Education Commissioner revealed live on 12 News Now at 4, schools in the capital city will be masking up. 12 News reporter Rob Nesbitt joins us now live in studio with more about her announcement and what other districts are doing. Rob? Mike, Providence Public Schools are still controlled by the state, so Ride has the power to require masks, a muscle that will be flexed in hopes districts follow suit with mask rules in their own COVID plans. For days, school districts have heard the words strongly recommended when it comes to masks. On Wednesday, 12 News learned that Ride will be requiring masks at Providence Public Schools. Providence plan, everybody's going to wear masks. You know, that's where I'm in charge, and I'm, this is what we're going to do. And it's going to serve as, um, as, a, you know, as a roadmap for other districts. Schools have until August 27th to submit their COVID plans to the state. I would expect the superintendents to follow the CDC guidance. Governor McKee says Rhode Island is recommending schools require masks for everyone indoors. He has the power to issue executive orders, but on Tuesday, he seemed unsure if he could change the recommendation of masks to a requirement. We may have the authority in, our, in the governor's office to do another mandate, but we may not. And uh, but we know the health department does if, the, if it rises to a level of, uh, of of critical nature in terms of a health issue. So Some districts are making masking a choice. The Johnston School Committee voted unanimously Tuesday night to let parents decide for their children. West Bay Christian Academy in North Kingstown drafted their mask policy four weeks ago, which is uh, in table groups. We're not asking kids to wear to wear masks. Headmaster Dr. Alex Littlefield says his private school can adjust their COVID policy depending on if the virus improves or worsens. If there's a mandate from the state or if, you know, this the Delta variant is just becoming more aggressive and it's a problem, then we'll also have a more aggressive response. Commissioner Infante Green told 12 News that it's up to the legislature to act on a statewide mask mandate, but a spokesperson for the General Assembly says Governor McKee maintains his executive authority in matters of health and safety. Reporting live in studio, I'm Rob Nesbitt, 12 News.